claims of racism and discrimination made against the Chandler Unified School District. Upset parents and the ACLU voiced their complaints at last night's school board meeting. Team 12's Brian West is in the Live Alert Center with a look at their claims and what school officials had to say. Brian? The school board meeting last night was supposed to sign off on new football coach Mike Zadebski, but things got heated. And because the district is unable to comment on things not on the agenda, the argument was pretty one-sided. We're not satisfied, we're not happy, and we shouldn't be. This is about racism at its core. Last night, parents, family members, and the ACLU spoke out against Chandler Unified School District at a school board meeting, making some bold racist allegations. Tonight, I'm going to share with you examples of just a few discriminating, distasteful, and disrespectful situations. At the center, Felicia Gillespie, the mother of teen Nathaniel Thomas, who is being tried as an adult in the Hamilton High hazing scandal. She pointed to eight examples of discriminatory actions in Chandler, including her son's suspension. My son, previously your black student, was suspended from Chandler Unified School District for a year, being tried as an adult for crimes he did not commit. All while the staff members, who also have charges recommended against them, were allowed to roam on campus. It took for me to stand in front of you all here, September 13th, to address the discrimination taken place before it was decided to reassign them that following Monday. She also brought up the controversial Snapchat video 12 News covered last week at Santan Junior High. Students yelling phrases so bad we can barely put the post on television. F those inwards. This is what your black students got to wake up to on Martin Luther King Day. Because we're limited by what we can say. You might have the idea we're, that we're uncaring and unsympathetic, and that couldn't be further from the truth. School board president Annette Oxier only had this to say to address the allegations. But we appreciate that you came tonight. We appreciate your words of advice, your, your words to help us. Nathaniel Thomas is charged with nine felony charges, including aggravated assault, sexual assault, and kidnapping. His mother has been very vocal throughout this entire investigation and maintains that her son is innocent of all charges. The 12 News I team, we've been there since the beginning when the story first broke, and we will continue to bring you any updates. In the Live Alert Center, Brian West, 12 News.